Hi there, my name's Lisa and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for showing up. I really appreciate you guys. So what are we doing today? Today we are going to start, restart, um, my sinking, fun, sinking funds tracker. I have not been very diligent in this and I think the last time I did this was maybe last year, maybe. Um, maybe not, it doesn't matter. We're gonna start over. I think this will be helpful for me to actually see the numbers and um, have the number in my head of what we have going on. And I'm gonna try to do this once a quarter. So this is the starting point. So we're going to go into the yellow binder, the car binder, and see what's up. And this one has, should have, let's see, 500. 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 565, yep, that's right. So that is what we'll put here, 565, and next will be tags and registration. I I saw Kathy's cash and coin. Kathy at Kathy's cash and coin do this, and so I, you know, I was, I had to try it too. So the tag should have 95, 20, 40, 60, 80, 95. That's good. Our tags are due in February, so this will just continue to build and be part of the general car binder fund tires so you know if there's overflow and there hopefully there will be we'll just and we need tires it will go to tires tires has 20 40 60 80 95 100 506 106 so that's pretty good because we know tires ain't pretty at all but necessary and tires are expensive i think the last time we got them for the truck they were probably eight or nine hundred dollars and my car, I don't know what, because I bought them at the dealer. I get everything at the dealer. It's just what I do. They were a little more expensive too. Oil change, 20, 40, 60. 20, 40, 60, 70. And we will just let this grow. And when they get to a significant, a significant amount in each envelope, I will uh, move it to the high yield savings account. Deductible. Can't wait to get that up to 500. That's what our deductible is, 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 15, 20, is that right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, that's 110, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 124. So we have a ways to go with that, but so much better than what I was doing this time last year, because I wasn't doing anything really. I wasn't being accountable. In my mind I was doing it, but I really wasn't. Future vehicle, 20, 40, 60, 80, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 120. So I have two envelopes for future vehicle. New car, you know, down payment, but um, I'm just gonna let it go like that and eventually I will combine them. Let's add that up. That is 1080. Ooh, and I have 1090 here. So I messed something up. Surprise! My math can't math. Um, I've made mistakes in deductible. So today it's 124. When I did it last time it was 134, but I have 124 in the envelope, so that's what it is today. All right, so let's move on to the next binder. This is, um, you know, it used to be my low priority, but I think all my binders are kind of priority. I just have broken them up and uh, made them more interesting for me. So beauty should have 300. Let's double check. This is for hair, hair care, hair care, haircuts and highlights, which I'm getting a haircut tomorrow. 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 3. So that's 300. It's a good thing I double check myself on these because I my math doesn't math very well. Miscellaneous. I had this rainy day, but I'm going to make it miscellaneous. You know, if I have the money, I'm going to put it in there that has five. And if I don't, I'm not. It's just like a backup for rainy day, but I'll change this. 
because I forgot to. Birthday. Uh, let's see. This gets stuffed every two weeks. 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. And it has 20 in the bank. So that should be a total of 110. My son-in-law just had a birthday. So I had to take 50 out. Electronics, this is for me. I want to work on getting an iPad. So 105. And a future car, I was gonna put another future car envelope here, but I'm not. And estate planning, well, I should put that in the right direction. I will just have two envelopes for estate planning. But that right now doesn't have anything. So, I can fill that up. All right, let's add those up. Put this back. That should be 520. All right, now this is my um, YouTube bolt folder binder. And it used to be my Lucky Bucks binder, but I was kind of waiting for YouTube to kick in. So now that's what this is. All right, and taxes will have, I'm expecting a larger tax bill this year because of some money we had to take out of a retirement account. So I am sending more of my eBay money to that. So, so far it has 500, 20, 40, 50. And that's probably gonna grow. I need to get that up to at least $1,400 by the end of the year. So more of my eBay money, which is not a lot, is gonna go for that. Support and giving, this is when I want to support somebody on their Amazon, a wish list, or just send them cash. If I Venmo somebody cash, so that'll be $10. P.O. Box, this has 10, 20. All right, that is due in January. Equipment, if I need anything for the YouTube business, I don't really think so. I mean, I'll just keep that there. And yearly subscriptions, this is for TubeBuddy. And that, I don't even know. I mean, I have TubeBuddy and I think I like it, but I don't know all that it offers and I need to work on that. So that's 10 in there. And Road to 5K. I am paying myself $5 for each, was it 25 subscribers? Just to keep me focused. I mean, and that's 30 so far. That will go to savings more than, more than likely. Well, yes, unless savings is done. So let's add those babies up. That is 6.30. That's good, moving right along. All right, the high yield savings account has these are digital and I stuff them I just don't think I share the numbers but I'm happy to do that so for taxes and insurance we have to pay that every year we don't have a mortgage and right now we have $1,030 in there and clothing I just keep that in the high yield because that's money kind of coming and going all the time so that's 280 and yearly subscriptions that's Amazon Aflac Microsoft Norton virus and what else? Oh, safety deposit box. Yeah. So that has 176. Let's add those up. And that is 1486. Let's add these up and see what we have. Thirty-seven sixteen. Is that right? Okay. Well, we're gonna go with it. Let's double check that. Yeah. Okay. So that is page one. I have three pages of these. It's a lot. So hold on to your hat. Okay. Let's do. Let's start here. I think. Yes, let's start here. This is my, well, you know, this is my favorite binder and it has morphed into uh, many savings challenges 
to whatever challenges and now it is a holiday so I save you know five or ten dollars a paycheck for each holiday whatever I can and these mini holidays they, they can sneak up on you so I wanted to go ahead and be prepared for that so Halloween has 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96. And I think I'll stop at 150. This will allow me to contribute uh, candy to the church, get whatever outfit or whatever the kids want, grandkids, for Halloween. We don't get candy. We don't get trick-or-treaters here. We're, you know, we're in a city, but we're kind of isolated. So, you know. That's okay. So for Thanksgiving, we'll get 50, 65. And I don't typically cook Thanksgiving, but in case I have to, this will be helpful. And um, I usually invite ourselves over to our in-laws and they, they and if they're in town. If not, I don't know. So I'm gonna try to get that up to 200 in case we always say oh we're not gonna cook I'm not gonna do anything we're gonna go out and eat hasn't happened yet I always end up cooking or going to their house neither which is bad <gasps> uh oh look at that I left out Christmas whoops okay made a boo-boo this is for Christmas dinner all right that's okay Next time we'll get it right. 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 85, 90. Is that right? Yep, that's right. So this will have $90. I do uh, fix, I do host thanks, Thanksgiving, Christmas at my house. So I'm going to try to get that up to 250. Depends. You know, it's kind of last minute. People know that they're invited, but. I don't really know until like two weeks before who's coming, but that's okay. I kind of pre-buy all year. And oh, crap, what did I say? 90. <coughs> Excuse me. Oofta. Valentine's Day. It's a big deal. It's my husband's birthday, and he's all into birthdays. So um, we have to make it about him and the kids and me. So we'll just add, keep adding until we can't add any more. I was thinking because of, you know, he likes to eat out. He likes all these things, maybe 200. We'll see if I get a hundred, I'll be happy. So 20, 25, 30, 35. It's a ways away. So we can build that slow and sure. That's fine. Fine and dandy Easter. That too, you know, I contribute to the church, you know, buy candy, help buy candy for the kids. They have a huge Easter egg hunt. And, you know, whatever the kiddos want to do here, we usually bake cookies and frost them and hide eggs until they never want to do it again. Hopefully that never happens. 20, 35, 45, 50, 152. So there's that. And Mother's Day is going to get... Mother's Day um, is going to get... Let's see, what do we have? 10, 15, 20, 25. We're going to get that up to probably 200. I know, I have lofty goals because I don't want to cook on Mother's Day weekend. So there's that. And we'll get what we can get. Father's Day. Same-o, same-o. I like these mini holidays. That has 15. So, um, again, we like to eat out on those weekends, I guess. And we don't really eat out a whole lot. This is just money that's going into the challenges later, so we'll just leave that there. And July 4th, Memorial Day, slash almost my birthday weekend, kind of. That's 15. We're going to get that up to a couple hundred eventually. So let's add these bad boys up and see what we have. Three ninety-three. Well, we're going to have to put that right there. So that we'll have to share. All right. So let's go into, I have one more small binder to go into. This is a binder I won from Amanda Budgets. And I really didn't know how to use it. 
and I've been slacking on a couple areas. So I would put my self care in here. And let's see what we have in here. It's 25, 35, 45, 46. I think I'm going to save up for a massage. I think self care is hard for women in general. I applaud those that do take time out and are good to themselves. Yay. Um, I do it in spurts. I'm just not consistent with it. So there you go. This is for my granddaughter. She graduates in 2031. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. This is where I have been slacking. Um, they have not been getting the attention. I do have investments that automatically go into their investment account through Stockpile. It's an app for your phone. Um, it's pretty interesting. They can have access to it. They can make, they can look and see what's going on. And if they want to buy something, if I leave a little cash in there, they can, but I have to approve it. But you know, it's just an introduction in, to saving with using stocks. 25, 35, 36, 37. So Caleb, the boy will graduate in 2027, so I really have to up my game on this. I'd like to at least get $500 in there, so we'll see. All right, Lucky Bucks. Lucky Bucks. They are in this clear binder. I moved them out of the red binder. So we have 50, another 50 is 100, 150, 225. I'm not gonna count all those. We'll just go with that. So that has 225. And now we can move on to the bigger binders. Let's put that over here. We're almost done. Hang in there. Hang in there. But I, I am enjoying this. I hope you are too. It really helps put in perspective all the hard work that we're doing to build our sinking funds and getting ready for future purchases. So there's that. All right, so we're in the big, long, long-term binder. Yeah, and show me the love. We're starting that over because we finished that challenge this week. And I need more, I need to be more diligent in saving money for our medical deductible. All right, $5,000 challenge that has 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 20, 30, 40, 750. So we'll put that, that I'm going to be sending more money to. Uh, this is, you know, this is just a savings account, but specifically I needed to start it for a hurricane roof deductible. Because if a hurricane comes through and knocks off our roof, that's at least $5,600. So there's that. Okay, emergency pet. This is getting places. For sure. So we have a thousand, twenty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, eleven hundred, ten, fifteen. That is great. Um, urgent care for pets is expensive. Been there and done that twice last year. Like over a thousand dollars each time. <sighs> There's no joke. Estate planning. Here's one that is going to get more attention this, this next half of the year. So what do we have? 120, 40, 60, 80, 92, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. So that has 240. And a future vehicle. This is the other savings. This is long-term savings. You know, where I hit the bigger scratch-offs and add money to that. So what do we have here? We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100. Well, it's coming along, but all you have to do is start, right? And Christmas 2024 is this envelope. It doesn't have anything yet, but we finished Christmas 2023. That has 1,200. And the high yield savings account, rainy day fund has 500. We finished that. And hurricane prep has 500. This is what is in the bank. 
guess I could include that in there. I'm not sure, but I went ahead and did it anyway because I feel accomplished when I do that. So let's add these up. Okay, let's add up all of these. So we have 4405 plus 393 plus 345. That gives us 5143. Okay, moving on. So let's go into dental. Let me put this binder up right over into the trash. Look, the sun's going in again. It was bright and shiny there for a minute. So. Let's see, Dental has 105, right? 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 100, 105. That's right. So we will mark that down. Dental has 105, and you know, my husband's going to the dentist Tuesday, so I'm optimistic, but he says there's something that hurts. Ugh. What does uh, Vision have? Should have about the same 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 110. Close enough. And then he has to go, I have to start going, you know, it's like every six months, I know this is gonna happen, I have to start going to the dentist too. But I'll wait for him to get his done. Actually, I think I go from the beginning of August. I have to go to the dentist and then the car place, you have to make an appointment every six months to get my car. Tires rotated, copay. What do we have here? 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 110. So just letting these add up for a bit and then they will probably all go into a general medical fund. Uh, or, or I'll just leave them this way. I'm not sure yet, but this is working right now. Deductible has 30. I haven't moved over the show me the love money yet, but that will be showing up at the end of the quarter because money will be going in and out, I betcha, after all these dental visits and all that good stuff. Yearly vet stuff. This is for the cat, Mitch, my semi-feral cat who's getting better and better each day. $30 and my 17-year-old Papillon for her checkups too. And her office visit usually runs $85. So we at least so we got to build that up because she was just there you know when you bunch it all together and you add it up it it, it, it looks pretty good it's pretty darn encouraging all right so now we're going to get into airfare this is our travel binder i had expectations of going somewhere this summer we didn't go and um it just wasn't feeling right wasn't prepped. Um, mostly it was a gut feeling. I just wasn't happy planning it. So I, we didn't go. It was a family reunion. They have it every two every two years. I, I could always go in two more years, but I haven't been since I uh, buried my parents up to Wisconsin. So I don't know if I'll ever go. It, it just, just weird. Anyway, airfare has 500, 10, 505, 10, 15, 20, 30. So we'll just let this accumulate until something does feel right. I think because we're still stuck in the bathroom renovation, because um, my husband has taken that over, and thank God, because I don't have to worry about it. Um, rental car, 500, 510, 15, 20. I mean, he has to get the drywallers here because he's ripped out all the drywall. He wants new drywall. And then he has to call the towel guy. So it's on his time schedule, not mine. It's a functioning bathroom that has a toilet, but the other bathroom has everything else. So thank God for two bathrooms in a house. Five, oh, 10, 15, 20 in gas. So we can work on building this up for hopefully a trip maybe later this year. Maybe. I just don't, I don't know. I don't know, it just doesn't feel like I'm gonna go. But that can always change. So eating out, this is for when we eat out or we get food. Usually when we travel, we'll get, this is $20. Once we get there, if we're staying like a week, like when we went to Rapid City, you know, we'll get a cooler and then we'll fill it up with 
snacks, like healthy snacks, apples, peanuts, sodas. And we, we keep that in the trunk and in our room. We typically eat out one meal, but we'll snack and make our own sandwiches just, just at our own pace. So, you know, and if we want to eat at a, whatever restaurant, hokey restaurant there is, we will. 10, 15, 20, 25. Pet boarding. Take care of Cricket when we go. So looking at this, I'm not really ready to go on a big, big trip. I have to do some more saving for it. And I think that was a reality check too. Touristy stuff. It could be souvenirs or excursions or whatever. So that's 25. Tips. Gosh, you need tips. And I tell you, every time you have to sign an iPad, once you do a debit, you have to tip any, you don't have to tip, but um, they want you to tip. 10, 15, 20, 25. Do you tip? Do you round up? Do you feel guilty if you don't tip? I have all those questions in my head. That's why I like to pay cash mostly. Unless I'm in a rush, I'll debit it. But then I don't have to have the obligation of tipping. And I will tip at certain places. But, you know, every place they want to do it. Weekend getaway. We're just going to build this up. I'd like to go to St. Augustine for a weekend. And, um... I will use some of this other money if we if I need to. But that's a thought, and I just wanted to build on that. So let's see what all that is. Eleven eighty, we're gonna go with that. Sounds about right. Alright, one more binder. I know, one more binder. I can't take it. This is my cute new home green binder. I, I like filling these up using the dice, letting the dice decide. It, it's mindless entertainment and relaxation for me. So, all right, General Home Fund, that has 687. And Pest Control, how much do you have? You have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 35, 45. We have a yearly contract that runs about 320 every year. So, and I do know, I'm pretty sure my taxes and insurance have some uh, padding in it for that, but just in case. Because, you know, taxes and insurance, crap shoot lately, it's always going to go up. Inside appliances, 5, 10, 15, 20, 30. Um, you know, just got to be ready. And of course, if it was major, we'd just you know pull from all the things and start over again but I like doing it this way it makes me happy outside home repair gets 20 and that would include a new water heater which we do need eventually I know my husband sits out we sit out on the porch and reflect on the day sometimes when it's not 105,000 degrees but um and talk about things we need to do for the house and his list is long and I really have to keep notes in my phone 10 20 30 I go what you gotta buy what? So, gotta start putting more cash away. A new mower. I want a new mower. Eventually, I'm gonna ride this one out. We've had it for, oh gosh, hmm, eight years. And I'm gonna save it for a John Deere. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. We had a used John Deere when we moved out here. And uh, we have a small house on an acre and we never could buy it now, but we bought it when the bubble burst in 20, 2008. And we could never afford it now, ever. So, I like to mow, and I eventually will get a new mower. $8.47. That's pretty good. When you see it all together like that, and I do keep it... What? Look at that, I have eight thirty-two in there. Well, must have made a mistake. Well, I did make a mistake. I double checked these numbers, added up again. It's 847, so that's what we're going to go with. Anyway, so let's add all these up. We have 385 plus 1180 plus 847. That gives us, let's see, we'll make this page one. So that'll give us 2412. And. So that is 5143. 
And page three is 3716. So let's add that up. Plus. Eleven thousand two hundred and seventy one dollars. What the what? So all that money has a job. Some of it is for savings, very little, but all of this will be going somewhere, and I feel so much better knowing that I will be prepped for it. So look at that. So at the end of let's see, June. July, August, September. At the end of September, at the end of September, we're going to bring this out again, and I think we'll do it every quarter because I can't pull it together to do it every month. If I can, I will, but ugh. I think at least every quarter would be good because it's uh, there's going to be some movement going on in here. All right, you guys, appreciate you so much. Thanks for hanging out with me today, and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.